guys celebrating in the middle of the ring, but we need to get down to fucking business. It's cool. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. The ring's been cleared. He said he wanted to go face to face with Jay Vice. Jay Vice, get your ass in here right now. Still haven't other pinball children yet, so this is still enticing as shit. It took everybody on the other team to pin Jay. That still proves that Opie is right. Wild card. Three years in the making. I love you, man. I love you. Here we are right now. At Frenzy's End. What a historical ass moment. How far we've come. To this point right now. How far we've come. Where we are here. Live. In the middle of this ring. And I'm looking across the ring right now. And a man that made my life. He made my life worth living. And then he decided to try to make my life a living hell. That's you, Jay. I only got one question for you. Are you happy with what you've become? Are you happy about what you have become? All for what, hmm? All for what? Look at me, man. All for what? Nothing. That's why. Right. Nothing, Jay. Look at me and look at you. On the last frenzy, in comparison to the very first, to the very first mayhem, if you really want to go that far, I'm the man, ain't I? And what are you? You're a shadow of yourself, staring me down in this room right now. Are you happy with what you've become? I hate you, Jay. I hate you. I hate your guts. I hate your face. I hate the fact that you're still here. I hate the fact that I had to do this. I really do. I really do hate the fact that this is what it's become. What did I show you, man? What did I show the world? What did I show every doubter? What did I show you? I showed you. This was always destined to be for me. Was it in spite? Sure. You're damn right it was in spite. 
Everything you see right here in front of you is in spite. Every man that you couldn't beat, I beat. Baskin Robin. Archangel. Kraken Dogma. Every single man that went up against you, guess what? I did them all. I finished them all. That's what I did. And that's something you couldn't do. Because God himself decided your fate. And yet for some reason, I'm allowing you the opportunity at this. Make no mistake about it, Jay. I'm giving you the chance to do something. To end this universe off as you being that guy. The guy you once were. The guy you are no longer. Because quite frankly, the roles have literally reversed. I have become the best in the world. And you have become the one on your knees. You have nothing else to say. You have nothing else to say to me. Because there is nothing much else left to say. And I wanted this face to face because you never had the balls to do it yourself. So allow me to do it. Allow me to speak to you. Jay. You broke my heart, and you ruined my life, but you couldn't kill me. Not if you tried your hardest to, you couldn't kill me. And it's boiling inside of you that I'm walking into the wild card with this championship. It's boiling up inside of you that I have become what you used to be, isn't it, Jay? Well, guess what? Karma is such a bitch to the best of the bitches. And you are... One sorry ass son of a bitch. Everything you did made me stronger in the end. Look at me now. Do you see me now, Jay? Look at me now. And look at you compared to me. You took everything away from me and I took every name anyone has ever given you. And the biggest one is the name of the best in the world. 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 I'm sure all these fans are pretty scared right about now that this final main event may end in tragedy. That this final main event may end the wrong way. But if you couldn't tell, nothing has stopped me and nothing will stop me. Nothing you try to do to me every time you try to fucking break me. Every time you try to fucking tear me down and make me want to go and kill myself. I didn't do it. I stood back up. I looked you dead in your face and I told you. But you had nothing on me. At this point in time, there is nothing you can do. I've already made my point proven. And you've proven that you are absolutely not the man you used to be. The Jay Vice of old is dead. That man killed himself, if you want to go there. That man killed himself. That man is gone, and he's never coming back. And if you think... That you're really just gonna walk into the wild card and do this? If you really think that you're just gonna do this, I got news for you. Not on my watch. No. I will make sure it never happens. I will make sure that the final image people see of you is you on the ground with blood coming out of your head onto your hands, realizing that you ruined your own life. By trying to ruin mine. I'm going to make these people realize. I'm going to make you understand. 
that everything you try to do did nothing in the end. Because this is the end. This is the end, and it is especially the end of Jay Vice. Because once I take the last time in the middle of that ring, in front of the old people in Miami, Florida, every single accomplishment that you've ever made in this ring, every single blood, sweat, teardrop you've ever dropped in this ring, will never be remembered for. Not one thing you've ever done will be remembered for. You will be remembered as the man that made the biggest mistake in his damn life. And I will be remembered as the man that avenged himself through everything you tried to do to me. Everything you tried to say to me. Everything you tried to do to make me leave this earth. You will be remembered as the man that brought it all upon yourself. Because this was your world. This was everything to you. Everything was around you. But now, your world ends. And open shit you on. Forever, bitch. I would take you seriously, but the fact is, everything that's coming out of your mouth resembles one word. Is pain. Don't lie to these people. Would you? Don't lie to these people, Opie. You never got over it. Stop lying. You know damn well. Ain't no Stan, ain't no Warjack ever gonna replace me and what I did for you. Ain't no man ever gonna do that. Because what I did for you saved your life. What I did for you can never be replicated. And you know that. And you know damn well. You don't really want to do this. You never wanted this. And you still don't want it. If I came to my senses right now and decided to hug you in comfort and bring you back into my life, you would do it in a heartbeat, wouldn't you, Opie? You know you would. Because I was your life. The brotherhood I gave you was your life. And I took it all away from you. Because a bitch ass like you don't deserve it. You don't deserve life. You keep trying to pin me as a bad guy. But the fact is all I wanted to do was just get rid of a problem in my life. All I did was show my sheer honesty when I kicked your ass out of my life. When I literally kicked your ass out. And like a clingy ex, the weird little shit that you are, you never went away. And now, the vengeance you're trying to cause upon me it's all because you're still in pain. And even if you do do the job at the wild card, you will never get over the fact that the best life you ever had is forevermore gone.
But the problem is, OP, I'm not going to let that happen. There's no way in hell I'm going to let you walk out of this on top. Because you're right. If I did let you do that, I would never, ever forgive myself. You don't know what's coming. You don't know what I'm bringing. You don't know what's about to happen to you. But I do. And I'll tell you. I'm gonna beat you with the wild card. I'm gonna ruin your life. Your boys, Stan and Jack, are gonna try and save you. But nothing will save you. And you will be dead. Death from your own hands. You're gonna kill yourself because of me. No! And when it happens, you are going to be lying in a coffin right next to your mother's. And I'm going to wear my nicest suit and tie. I'm going to put that championship that you once held on top of your tombstone. And then I'm just going to piss all over you. And nothing would ever make me happier in this world than to see you gone and ridden from it. Nothing in this world would make me smile like the sight of you not existing in it. I made many regrets in my life. This ain't one of them. My biggest regret was ever saving you from yourself. My biggest regret was keeping you here, bringing you here, allowing you here. And all of that goes away with one super You'll never beat me. And you know. Because you know. that I know you best. You know. That the wild card. Is the end. For you. I took away your happiness. I reside in your mind. And I am your poison. I am. Judge. Jury. Executioner. Tragic of them all. 
and I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to be the reason for it. You try, but you will fail. You will die. And I will live on forever. No, as the best in the world. Talking about my death. You love talking about me going down, and I know you. I, I know I, I know you believe everything you're saying. But if you really think that's what's going to happen, all you need to know is one thing. All of you people in this arena and every arena you occupy throughout the world. Thank you so much. You kept me up. You kept me here. And you made me realize that I was made to be the man that I am today. Jay, you want to see me dead? You want to be the reason that I'm gone? You just got to realize one thing. That the world now knows. I was born to do this. You can super kick Jay. That's all I to I was born to do this. This is the exact image of the wild card last year. Except. Opie ain't the one on the floor, it's Jay. Look at those fucking hands. Final words is I was born to do this. Leading right out of his head like he said he was going to. Opie Smith walks out of the final frenzy on top. But will he walk out of the final show of all time? The same. That's vengeance of you in the fucking maker. 367 days later. Will Opie top it off at the wild card in the final match in the war?
the end Beautiful friend This is the end My only friend The end Of our elaborate plans The end Of everything that stands The end No safe 